Manuel Unzueta, artist, Santa Barbara, California. Tell me the story behind you and all of this. Okay, listen, I've been an artist since I was five years old, and I've been doing exhibitions for over 40 years, and I'm very close to Carpinteria. So we had a successful show a few years ago, and they said, let's do it again, because it was so much fun. So, you know, when it comes to Latino art, this, uh, this show, we know it's going to be hot. There's going to be music. We know there's going to be food. There's going to be art. There's going to be, you know, plants. Because to me, I want people to have a total aesthetic experience. I want people to talk to the artists and everything. Caminos is just a name in Spanish that means roads or paths. And that's the name of this show? That's the name. Of, and this is Caminos 2. This is Caminos number 2. And the idea is to do it again, to support the gallery, to invite the Latino community to be part of the arts and the community at large. And what gallery are we at? We're here at the Carpinteria Arts Center. Carpinteria Arts Center in Linden Avenue. And the idea is to showcase art, visual arts. I'm into music, I'm into many things, but sometimes I notice, and I know that, that the visual arts sometimes it takes an extra effort to get the people here, to observe the art, etc. But we are sharing this exhibition with children from the school system in Carpinteria, junior high, high school, teachers, because people need to experience that. I mean, that's my belief since I had my first show at 17 until now. Just having a good time. What's the story of how you got into art? Um, listen, uh, I grew up in Chihuahua, Mexico. And in my grammar school in Mexico, art was a big thing. So when I got to Santa Barbara uh, as a teenager, I said, wow, you know, in this country, they pay for doing art. And I went all the way to my master's at UC Santa Barbara in art. And, you know, it's just a beautiful ride. I got into art because Mexican art is a great thing. You know, the Aztecs, the Mayas, all the way to Diego Rivera, Frida Kahlo, Jose Luis Cuevas, and then my parents that also like art and music. I don't know, it's just part of me. And I don't think that's an extra effort. I just do it because I want to do it. What do you get out of doing art? And uh, a terrific aesthetic experience, and it's just a bonus in my life, you know, to keep on painting, doing art in every aspect. Do you have any stories that come to mind about your art life? Well, the painting behind me, it's uh, a painting that I've been in the process for a long time, but my studio, my studio burned down on March 1st, 2013. And I decided to do this painting as a, you know, as an extra effort of all the pieces that I lost in 2013. But uh, it's been very hard for me over I this bet. experience. So to pick up a painting again, to pick up a brush, is very hard for me. But this painting behind me is very personal about an Aztec legend and almost like a mini mural, because I like to paint murals. Was there any lessons you learned from having your artwork burned? Well, no, no, it was, a, it was a traumatic experience. I could have died in that, in that fire, but it was not meant to be. So the fact that I'm standing here before you, it's a bonus. And what do you feel when you do art? Oh, no, my God, there's no explanation. You see, to have a, a board, to have a canvas, and, and to have that canvas and, and make it happen. You know, it's, there's no explanation. Would you like to give out an email address for yourself? Manuel unz at hotmail.com or you can go into Manuel Unsueta Artworks and you can see some of my murals in there. Well, thanks for organizing this show today. Thank you very much for being here.